I wasn't originally planning to do this video, but after searching the internet, dear God, I have to. All right, iPhone Seven. Again, this thing is blowing up on the internet. I didn't. I've never in a million years made a part two to a Wyatt Talks Techie, but boom, there it is. All right. Uh, it's everywhere. Finally, I'm actually happy. You know why? It's being recognized for not being good. Thank God. I'm not saying no, I'm like an evil dude, like, I'm going to win the war of slavery or something stupid. Um, but finally, people are starting to see the Apple is slowly just taking away all features that are universal. They're turning their phone, they're turning their products in general into non easy to use non accessory applicable devices say um they started it all out with the uh, iPhone charger being different from a regular um, micro USB and it only got worse it got worse to the point where you can't it, uh. and let's not even get started on the MacBooks uh, I've talked to my f over at Rock Camp. I brought my laptop and I wanted to, uh, I wanted to show him, or no, I brought my, th um, thumb drive because I had a song to show him. And, um, you, you can't put a, you can't put a USB drive into a MacBook because God knows the second you try, they'll make a different kind of entire different. Um, USB and USB uh, isn't a USB uh, doesn't that mean like universal uh, something something bus which has to do with the power and transfer of information so basically Apple entirely denied the universal part of things which I give them it's a very, very smart way to get a lot of cash. And another thing, the AirPods, their uh, new official Bluetooth uh, earbuds. I'm, I wish I touched on this a little on the original video, otherwise I wouldn't be making this, but think about it. How easy would those things be easy to lose? Say, um, you're like me. I listen to music in school. Not like in class or like, not like, mm, teachers talking. I don't freaking care. I listen to my music. Yo, Jacob Sartorius sweatshirt. I'm kidding. Obviously, I hate Jacob Sartorius. Or no, I'm listening to Mishova's, uh, I play Pokemon Go every day. So, um, basically what I'm trying to say is... Sure, it'll be a lot more convenient, but when haven't you lost your earbuds before? It's only going to get worse, because you may find the one, but you won't find the other one. And that, and you've got to god dang charge it. I don't know about you, but that's pretty stupid. Again, I have Bluetooth headphones, my Bluetooth headphones... Uh, have a pretty long battery life like every week or so I throw it on the charger while I'm showering and uh, boom I'm, I've got like a good week of battery life I don't do I don't fully listen to music for seven hours straight but I know that's pretty good performance but think about it you're gonna lose these eventually when you do well, that's $160 plus tax plus shipping down the toilet and getting the iPhone set. What is innovative about it? I truly want to know. Nothing. 
There is nothing new. It's using the same OS. Uh, sure, maybe it's got a different um, sub menu that you can uh, press. It's uh, the only thing that's changed is everything. Ooh, philosophy all in your mind. No, no, it's, it's not. Look, I'm not saying every Android phone company is the best in the world and they make innovations every time because God knows they don't Samsung Galaxy Note 7 what is the god dang difference you tell me there's literally nothing you could get an S6 and be perfectly fine with it but uh I don't understand maybe I shouldn't it seems that Apple is trying to transfer itself. Okay, so say right here is all the tech companies of the world. You've got your Microsoft, you've got your Asus, you've got your uh, Sony, and basically any other average company you could think of. Now, over here is where Apple is putting themselves next to nobody else. Because they don't want to work with other people. They want their customers to be hooked to their brand. Kind of reminds me of drugs. Is the iPhone a drug? Are they brainwashing people? No. No, they're not. In the end, here's what I'm trying to cover. iPhone is completely separated itself trying to not be compatible eventually it won't even have Bluetooth it'll use some kind of different ray just to use the droppable AirPods literally all they did was put a Bluetooth chip in there cut off the wires AirPods plus battery modules I give you that and um, innovation nah uh, excitement nah but finally, people are starting to see that I'm right about Apple. I think that's pretty cool. However, what the heck is this video gonna do? Nothing. As sad as it is, every company I hate, every company I'll always rant about, is gonna have trouble. It's not gonna make it. Sadly. But maybe Review Tech USA's will. So, um, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment below what you think of the entire iPhone, uh, Apple separating themselves situational. My, okay. And also, um, if you're interested in guitar, Nerf, or the WAS dudes, please, uh, subscribe. It's free. Anyways, I'm Wipe Beardsley, and it's time. Peace out.